A few months ago, Safaricom, my local internet provider, upgraded my router to a dual band Wi-Fi router. This router is both a 5 gigahertz and 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi router. The previous one was only 2.4 gigahertz. So I'm here today to talk about the advantages of 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi. So the 5 gigahertz range is faster and less vulnerable to interference. That is because there are less devices using the 5 gigahertz range. I have two phones over here, the Infinix Note 11 Pro and the Infinix Zero X Pro. Both of these devices are dual band Wi-Fi devices and this is what you see when you search for Wi-Fi networks. So this is a screenshot from the Infinix Note 11 Pro and you can see that I have two Wi-Fi names with exactly the same name but one has a hyphen and 5G so that is the 5 gigahertz range. So not all phones will support this 5 gigahertz range so you have to check with your particular phone model. So this is a screenshot closer to the router. So this is the second screenshot and I took this screenshot like 7 meters away from this router. And this shows you perfectly the biggest disadvantage of 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi. And that is that it has a shorter range and cannot penetrate walls. So I normally use both. When the phone detects that the 5 gigahertz is weaker, it automatically switches over to the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi. So 5 gigahertz network is perfect for smartphones and laptops as well as streaming devices which are in the same room with the router. Otherwise, just use the 2.4 GHz network if you will be in another room.